بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على سيدنا ونبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أما بعد إن شاء الله تعالى we are starting فقه classes short lessons those are about فقه فقه is the law that can teach us how to correct our prayer how to correct our psalm, how to correct our fa uh, zakat, how can we purify ourselves in a correct way, how we can correct our ibadah and our business, our, uh, our family affairs and everything that is about in our daily life. Now we are having a little bit introduction in this lesson. When we are applying a job from a company, that company may ask you your work experience or your qualifications or you will have a training. Most companies will not say to you, start your job straight before they ask you anything of this. So today, if we wanted to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, do we think the knowledge of the ibadah, the knowledge of the purification, the knowledge of the prayer, the knowledge of psalm, the knowledge of the fast and uh, zakat, the knowledge of hajj, the knowledge of the business? Most of us don't care if they worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the best way or not but if they wanted to fill their forms if they know they have to check their form if it is correct or not several times if they do not know how to fill their forms they will look for someone who can help them they will book an appointment with the communities but if they wanted to fill the form to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, if they wanted to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, they will do the ibadah while they are ignorant from their actions. They, while they do not know what uh, nullify or invalidate the ibadah and what can make it correct or invalid. So every Muslim has to think about his or her ibadah before everything because the most important thing is to is to think about your hereafter your akhirah and then think about your worldly matters otherwise the day of judgment Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will reject or or uh, all your actions and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will say to you you worshiped me while you are ignorant so your prayer was invalid your psalm was invalid your zakat was invalid your hajj and umfa were invalid your business were wrong you were practicing a lot of wrong actions in your business we do not know what is our right and what is obligatory upon us if we do not understand Allah's religion. Barakallahu Inshallah ta'ala we will have short lessons. Those can be light for us. Those can teach us what is right and what is wrong. How can we correct our ibadah? See you. In the next lesson, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.